What's the best part about working in the arts education environment for you? When I began my tenure here as a teaching artist, Erica Kraft was um, the education director. And what she, along with the staff here at SMEC, provided and put together in the form of professional development for the teaching artist was incredibly valuable. One of the things that I really like um, by performing and sharing Japanese culture and folk music and, and folk dance with the kids is getting to introduce to them like a new culture, something mm -hmm. that's, that they are not familiar with. The community arts mural program was an amazing one where we essentially um, they create public art wow. with um, young people and to know now that some of these murals are up and some of these the, the, the teenagers are now adults probably drive by and say, look, I helped mm -hmm. paint yeah. that. And I think that's really one of the strongest things that the arts can provide is a sense of ownership, a sense of pride in one's, you know, one's home. This year we're celebrating SMAC's 40th anniversary and roll into any given child's eighth year. Wow. What mm -hmm. thoughts and emotions come to mind when you think about that? Boy, it went fast. Eight years, because I was in from the, the beginning. from the beginning with the Any Given Child program. I think the program has done has affected many children, has um, touched the lives of teachers in those classrooms. I oh, have yeah. seen it over and over again, where a kid who's too cool for school is like up and engaged, and the teacher goes, oh, "I, this person I didn't know last week," mm -hmm. and whatever the label is prior to coming into the classroom sometimes and you you just hope for those moments sometimes the experience with the arts shifts everything for a child and then every those labels don't apply anymore again I worked with the Commission quite a while ago um, at a time when it was still on on 10th Street in the old building and it really affected me from that point on understanding how programs are built understanding you know the way to to develop successes, the way to, to touch people, the way to reach people who normally would not have been reached. With the, the cutting in, in government spending on the arts, especially in California, I was really worried that, that SMAC wouldn't be able to with, withstand that. Mm -hmm. And I'm so thankful and grateful for all of the work that um, like Sam and other predecessors who have been working through the commission through those 40 years to make sure that, that it's, the program is, is still still in existence today and, and going strong. Mm -hmm. I think it's, mm -hmm. it's really wonderful. I feel really grateful and, and privileged to, to be just a small part of it.